when you're managing volunteer jobs with multiple job shifts that are occurring in the future, uh, the Salesforce.com nonprofit success pact actually has, and the, the volunteers application has a, a, a nifty feature called the, the job recurrence schedule. And so what you do is if you go in on a specific job, now this is the lightning version, so what you're seeing is a detailed uh, tab and a, a related tab. We're going to go to the related tab because this is these are kind of uh, objects. Or these are different lists that are related to the the, the researcher uh, job. Uh, so we're going to talk with this video about the job recurrence schedule, which is about creating a job that will have multiple shifts in the future. So by creating it here, we'll end up seeing multiple job. Um, you know, multiple shifts. We could also then in the next video we'll talk about volunteer recurrence schedules, which is where you've got a volunteer who wants to uh, to volunteer in the future and and how that's going to look. So at this point we're going to create a a, a new um, job recurrence. Uh, we have a Friday and a Monday, so I'm going to create a Wednesday every Wednesday, and we're going to start it this Wednesday. And and what I'm going to do is to say let's go on ahead and and put 8 o'clock in here. We can put in an end date, although if you if you don't put in an end date, it just continues. You can see this isn't a required, there's no asterisk here that says it's a required field. Uh, duration is required, so let's give it a, a, a two-hour duration. And I'm going to have a max of, of three volunteers at this point. And then just as a, a placeholder, what I'll do is to put in here Wednesday 8 p.m. just so I know uh, kind of what this was that we were creating. I'm going to save that. It was created, and we can see here that in fact there is a, a new schedule. And if we go out to the shift calendar, and we look at the current month, we see that in fact there are uh, these um, shifts are scheduled. So uh, in the next video, we'll talk then about how to associate volunteers with these new job shifts that are created.